Hey guys, this is gonna be a two, um, like a few minute, um, short review, but we're gonna be reviewing Security Breach action figures, and you're not gonna believe this, you guys. I got Golbit. The Golbit plushie, it's mine! And, along with Golbit, and this, this, um, I don't know why it's on this. My brother put it on us. I got the Five Nights at Freddy's coloring book. Let me know if you want me to do some coloring and stuff like that. But today we're going to be reviewing this book. And maybe whenever we get to a thousand subscribers, we'll do, um, we're just going to do a live stream of me coloring in some of these pages. So there was a sneak peek, but we're going to draw that later. Oh, and I also got the little bit Funko Pop. So, these two are going to go in one video, but I don't want to bore you guys what I'm going to get in the future. I'm going to buy, a, I'm going to totally buy a lot more plushies. Like, I'm going to buy the new wave, but let's move on to, to the actual review. So first we have Freddy Frogbear. He's an interesting character because... Um, the action figure is interesting because it's like hollow. It's see-through, basically. He came with the his accessory is an icicle. His accessory is an icicle. Um, icicle. And there's finally no upper teeth. Um, we got the the frosting on him and such like not frosting really, but we have his thing up here. I don't remember what it's- a mistletoe, it's a mistletoe. So, there's a, um, Freddy Frostbear. Now let's move on to Security Breach. Now we have Glamour Freddy. He comes- his accessories are a microphone stand and a microphone. Um, along with that we have Glamour Freddy himself. Um, he, he has painted toes, um, but his- his head is reused from the Funtime Freddy head, and his hat's slightly moved with the earring on top. And then we also have these cheap, um, shoulder things, which is really cheap. Like, you can break them. But anyways, Glamrock Chica next. So Glamrock Chica, Chica moved her, her guitar. Um, there's a paint mistake, and the head is used off of Chica the Chicken from Wave 1. So, um, I would say she's the second accurate one, minus upper teeth. Oh, and this upper teeth, these upper teeth, uh, on Glamrock Freddy are wrong. So, yeah, they're supposed to be sharp. Um, but I like this figure. This figure is one of the better ones of this set. We have Roxanne Wolf using the Fo Rockstar Foxy head, I'm pretty sure. So Rockstar Foxy comes with her keytar. Um, that's what this thing is called, a keytar. He has a, she has a tail. The tufts of hair. What is that? Why is that on there? Um oops. And also she I got it back on. She has the earrings. They're really nice. Why? A great figure. Um, let's move on to Montgomery. Montgomery, he comes with his, um, guitar. I think this is my favorite, honestly. Um, I think it's wrong teeth, but correct me if it's wrong, if I'm wrong. He has a tail. I'm not sure of the head base, um, but... He actually looks like, he kind of looks like the actual character on, I'm just looking through the book. Oh, he's missing one thing, these things. So, he's not the accurate one, but he's still heading in the right place. Probably our worst action figure of the day, Vanny. Um... Why does it, her head look like a donkey? Dude. And she has a knife. Soda marks. Everything but the head is good. The body's good. 
I, what are her feet though, dog? And most of these figures, minus Glen, um, minus Frostbear, um, has the swivel hips, by the way. So, there's your review. Hope you guys have a good day. And I'm going to start reviewing this. And, hold on. The little bit plushy. Along with the Funko Pop. Because I haven't made a review of the Funko Pop. Anyways, so hope you guys have a good day. And bye.